Much love part, you guys. I want, I want to speak about the divine spiritual mission and how you can attune our, yourself to it. How you can attune yourself to your highest potential, to that really, that version of yourself that is free and wants to expand itself and is actually empowered and wants to be complete and is amazing. You know, because I believe that our life's mission is not necessarily about what we create and what we do. It's more about who we are in the process. It's about what we become in the process. You know, of course, it's important to step into a creative process and it's important to step into action. At the same time, there is just beauty in, there is beauty in just being your complete self being your complete self and realizing how much power you have within yourself and i realized that in order to step into this divine life mission i have to forgive my past i have to forgive my past and i have to forgive myself in the process i have to let go of the attachments that i have to myself to up to my feelings to my psyche to my way of thinking it's about regenerating ourselves it's about really stepping into our awakening maybe it's about stepping into a higher state of consciousness you know and i realized that in order to step into our life's mission we have to think about what our purpose is we have to imagine a desired reality for us to be into we have to imagine what our best self is and actually going ahead and following that you know i also realized that in order to step into your divine life life's mission you have to heal yourself in the process you have to really uh, question yourself you have to really look within yourself for answers you have to in a way release uh, that wounded part of yourself that is stuck in your emotional body and how do we do this we accept ourselves we accept ourselves as we are we are really uh, looking in the past and we are really embracing negative experiences that haven't been accepted you know because when you don't accept an experience when you are not fully living an experience then there is a stuck energy inside your vibrational body. But I, what, I, what I come to realize is the fact that I always get the chance to heal this energy. I always get the chance to heal this energy. I always get the chance to focus on the present moment and on the things that I want to create. And I really want to mention creativity here as a good tool to increase your vibration. A good tool to step into your most powerful self, which is your higher self, which is actually you in essence, you know, you are your own guidance, you are your own spiritual master and karate kid, you know, you are your own, you are your own master, you are your own master, you know, so in order to step into this divine life's mission, you have to raise your energy, raise your energy and really um, attune yourself to your best potential. You know, it's about looking at your future desired self and actually grabbing everything from that future and actually doing it in the now, you know, because everything is happening in the now. Everything is happening in the now. And the more that you increase what happens in the now, the more that you allow yourself to step into high vibrational habits in the now, you also influence your future self and your future self will actually thank you for that will actually thank you for that you know so it's about being content with where we are because the only way to get more is to be grateful for everything that already is the only way to get more is to be grateful for everything that already is so the universe works in a neutral way the universe won't give you what you want the universe will give you in resonance with the type of energy that you have 
okay the universe will respond to you the universe doesn't offer stuff you know it is us that are connected to universal intelligence that get to build and create our own reality you know so small steps small steps not giving up not giving up small steps and attuning yourself to good habits good habits and really living um, a healthy life guys a healthy life will increase your vibration a healthy life will expand your auric field a healthy life will expand your consciousness you know so i realized that it's all on me you know i am while the universe is is responding to me i realized that it's not about maybe attracting stuff into my life but it's about radiating radiating myself it's about increasing my vibrational body's energy it's about increasing my potential it's about stepping into the work it's about being curious about life and <clears throat> i realized that curiosity curiosity is really a good powerful tool for us to gather more and for us to allow more into our lives you know because it happens in the life's journey that we get stuck into into patterns we get stuck into habits that are keep repeating we get stuck you know but when we dare to let go of these patterns when we dare to let go of what is not serving us anymore when we dare to really open our energy to a new level we get to really increase our energy and we get to really step into our life's purpose we get to accomplish everything that is necessary we get to accomplish and we get to open our hearts to new experiences okay guys so in order to step into your life's mission you gotta realize what your truth is you gotta question yourself you gotta question the universe you gotta question that part of yourself that is wounded you know you gotta heal your inner child you gotta be yourself in the process you know so authenticity stepping into action being curious about life opening yourself and allowing yourself to feel the good the bad the up the down the left the right allow yourself to be a mess and feel everything okay the fifth tool is connect to yourself connect to yourself and hmm really accept yourself in the process you know so i realized that life is a magical journey guys life is a magical journey and the universe will open the secrets to those who are following their hearts you know so follow your heart follow your heart begin to let go more and realize that you are actually a free spiritual being you are free in the process you are free to build and create anything that you desire and in a way i realized that what is meant to you, what is meant for you will actually come in your way you know the moment that you go towards it so it's about going towards it and it's about receiving you know it's about masculine energy and it's about feminine energy you know a combination a combination so it's about going for it action and it's about allowing yourself to receive allowing yourself to receive feminine you know circular abstract you know but the masculine is more dynamic and the masculine wants to protect the masculine wants to offer the masculine wants to be complete at the same time the feminine is more round you know so from my perspective there is a need of, for both you know action and relaxation activity and passivity it's about being your complete self and if you feel like you are not enough if you feel like you are not enough if you feel like you are struggling with life if you feel like life has thrown at you too much allow yourself to take a step back allow yourself to take a step back and allow yourself to just be for a moment just be for a moment be in your body feel the pain feel the 
feel the, the stuff that is wounding you, feel everything. And from that point, make the conscious choice of really opening your heart to the present moment, opening your heart to what is right here, right now. Okay. So we all come with the mission, you know, we all come with the mission. And my suggestion is if you want a big life, if you are asking for a big desired life, go ahead and do the work, go ahead and appreciate everything that is in your life go ahead and be awesome go ahead and be yourself in the process you know so go ahead and be yourself in the process this is all that you need to be authentic to be yourself to be your most complete self this is how to step into your life's purpose you know and again maybe it's not necessarily about struggling so hard it's not about struggling so hard it's more about finding your own flow it's more about finding your own flow and it's more about extracting what is necessary for you and let it go of what is not necessary for you you know they talk about consuming versus creating you know the more that you consume is the more that you waste your energy the more that you create is the more that you increase your energy you know so yeah I also want to mention perfection you know so many of us are so struggling with uh, the question of how how will how will this actually go you know and we are stuck in that fear but when we let go and we really let go of that perfection we really step into our uniqueness we really step into that state that is not perfect you know we really step into that state that is not perfect and we forgive ourselves we love ourselves we embrace ourselves we step into our best selves you know so guys thank you for watching this today's video about how to step into your purpose your purpose may be about anything it may be about going into nature. It, it may be about reaching a high goal, a high ideal. It may be about anything. It may be about anything. It may be about just being yourself in the process and enjoying the little things in life. It may be about being curious about science, about how things work in this universe. It may be about your spiritual side. It may be about sports, music, whatever. Go ahead and follow your heart because that is the best way to increase your vibration you know so yeah be amazing be amazing and realize how powerful you are guys okay this is today's video i also do one-on-one -on -one coaching sessions so if you're interested in working with me feel free to send me a message and let's step into the work if you are new to my channel feel free to subscribe also leave me a comment letting me know what's up because I have, um, I'm thinking about raising my YouTube community and I'm thinking about really expanding this YouTube channel because I feel that I grow a lot lately and I feel like I'm closer and closer to my best potential. I'm closer and closer to my life's mission. And that is such a beautiful thing actually, okay? So guys, thank you for watching and Let's do the dance, let's do the samba and see you on what is coming up next. Okay, see ya guys and much peace. I love you.